Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to the irony of gaming and this is Counterside Tutorial Part 8. Um yesterday I'm not sure what the maintenance maintenance was about, but um Yeah, I'm guessing that they probably had to fix something. Probably some random thing or whatnot. But we're back at it again and this time we're gonna start we're gonna get straight to this operation thing so we can finish up all the episodes um i'm going to try and attempt to beat to beat this all the way up to episode five so uh let's see what's gonna happen but before we do that you already know we gotta do the dailies first again we're gonna be switching these out because we do not want to spend any of our atp cores we have a lot of business cards now Okay, so perform 20 and 10 battles. That's an easy one. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's go, let's go through the world map first. Collect some materials. Oh, wow. It was pretty close, too. Okay, so it looks like I gotta add some more. Um, I, gotta, I gotta add some more partners to, to finish it. We almost finished that raid too. Oh, nice, a dive. This is a level thirty dive. See again. So, like I was saying before, when you upgrade the uh, PR uh, department, there's a chance that you'll get like a higher version of this so far. But as we as we travel down the depths a lot higher, you're gonna see this become a lot higher. But for now, um, I'm gonna save this for a little bit later. So in the meantime, I'm going to increase this. No, no, I'm going to, I'm gonna do this. Like, um, let's set some more missions. Um, yeah, let's get these missions done. Okay, let's get the normal stuff, the free recruit, like I was saying before, <clears throat> get a free recruit and we get a free 10, uh, 10 planet points. Oh, we got some more rolls here. Let's get the rest of these out. Ooh, we got a robot. Okay. Let's see what we get. <laughs> Is it a new unit? Okay, okay. Now this has gotten really interesting. Okay, this is pretty lucky. So we got a pretty good sniper. That's amazing. Okay, we're definitely going to try and level her up and add her to the team. Whoa, we got another one. Okay. Hello. Who else are we going to get? Ah, okay. Got our Rob. Is that everybody? Alright, let's see. Will we get another robot? 
<laughs> three times in a row wow this is what you could call a uh, best case scenario is it another oh wow okay another new unit okay so we got another chinatsu not bad Okay, not bad. Wow. Not bad at all. Okay, best case scenario. Oh, and look at this. We got a whole bunch of stuff here. I'm going to collect these. And now we're gonna we're going to um, attempt to get more EXP and we're going to try and level up this sniper. She's she's going to play a very good part, very big part in this team. But before that, I what I wanna do is I want to increase Chinatsu's tactical update. And this will help us get a lot closer to our our goal okay ah this is great okay um let's go to the dorm system first let's uh let's get our oh wait wait, wait. before we even do that this is, this is what I probably should have done on in the last part. We need to we need to get some more partners. The more the more partners you get. Uh wait. Oh okay. They received too many. The more the more partners you get the easier your raids will be and the more uh, points you'll get for um, the other uh, recruitment thing because we want to make sure that we start increasing our business cards as we get an excess amount Okay, that'll be it for now. Alright, so we're going to go into the dorm system here. Let's go here. We'll interact. Nice. So we got our 90 points. Send some more business cards. Alright, so we're going to go into missions. Collect some more rewards. As you can see, we're getting a whole bunch of the blue tickets. Um. Oh, of course. Didn't forget at all. Yep. Simulations, always do them. You want to make sure you're doing those every day. We might be strong enough to start doing the, um, you know, start getting higher up. <sighs> All right, let's continue collecting some more of our materials. That we need, and resources that we need. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so we go to the supply area. Hmm. I'll do about 93 this time. Fantastic. Okay, and I want to get more of like the military stuff that we have, but 
Let's do 36. Now again, too, if I wanted to, I could also just use um, this right here as well. But I wonder, how much is that? Okay, so it's always 50. And doing this will give us 250 for 10K. Okay. We could do that if we need to. If need be. Because, I mean, we do get another 1,000. So I'm, But I was planning to put the 1,000 to increase the management system. Well, the, the management uh, section on there with the... Right here. Because I, I want to at least have maybe like 300. But what I can do is I could just go to the trash can area, do auto select, and let's see what else I can delete. Okay, 87. So I'm allowed to get that much. And. You see, once you get everything down packed, everything just starts to become second nature. And the game will just keep throwing more rewards at you. Okay, so let's see the free currency. Nice. We get more fusion cores. We still got to participate in at least five raids. And we still have to limit break our, um, our units to reach this. Most of the, uh, like this one right here, this is more end game. We have to get to the end game first by completing episode five. We can craft some gear, but not yet. And we still got to do our dives. And we still have to do a limit fusion, which I'll explain once we reach that point. Oh, and the gauntlet. Yes, we, we definitely got to do that too. And we'll we'll cross that bridge once we get there. But I definitely want to see if we could breeze through this um, these episodes. Okay, so we're at episode four. Okay, let's see. I think Yang may be enough for now. So we'll take Eris out. And we're gonna put in Shaolin. Shaolin. Okay, we gotta take some of Eris's gear. Oh man, I, I can't really do anything with that, huh? Okay, that's fine. Oh, put this here. You know what? Before I even increase anything, we're going to just we're just gonna we're just gonna piggyback off of the XP of the um, um what is it the episodes first, just so we can get there a lot quicker or a lot easier. Try to get them to level one hundred. <clears throat> yeah, as you can see, we're still breezing through the content. Still a little bit easier. 
저들이 두려워해야 할건 고작 큰일 날 뻔했다. 이쯤아 보스, 승리란 일장 춘몽처럼. 인류의 의지가 내 뒤를 지키고 있어. 쇠각을 거들어 주지. 최대 출력으로 쇠각을 거들어 주지. 우린 할수 있어요. 어어한데 어. 오래 기다려줬다 어. 큰일 날 뻔했다 잊지마 보스 승리란 일장 춘몽처럼 겉없는 법 Alright, nice, nice. Nice. Okay, so she's level five now. Gonna try gonna try and see if we can get through this with uh just the level one shit. Hunter, 고작 카운터 한 명이 아니야. 나이스. 아, 큰일 날 뻔했다. 잊지마 보스. 승리란 일장 춘몽처럼 겁없는 법. Oh, got another set of gear for um for a uh, counter. It's good. Okay. 이번엔 어떤 장비죠? 양각대, 스코프. Level seven. Oh, this might be a boss fight. Yep. I think this is like what? Um, day four or day five? <clears throat> but as you can see, we. You can see how fast we progress through the game. Okay. 
일장충몽처럼 겉없는 법 <웃음> Alright, Act 2 현장은 지금부터 내게 맡기도록 최대 출력으로 뭐가 새카맣게 몰려와요 드라이브각을 거스름지 두려워해야 할 건. 고작 카운터 핫. Nice, more soldier gear. <coughs> Again, I'm just gonna, you know, continue. I'm gonna continue skipping the story. Don't want to spoil nothing for you guys. But it's best that you guys experience it for yourselves. Great story, by the way. Oh, these guys. <laughs> I forgot about them. <laughs> then they got a few of them, they got like paper bags on their head. <laughs> All right, we are steamrolling. ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。ほねるないしが降りない。
것은 승리란 일장춘몽처럼 겁없는 법. <웃음> All right, we're slowly building up the uh, courts as well. Okay, level 11. Oh, it's these creepy things again. Oh, this one this time this one has a person. Oh man, you see that? You see how creepy his face look? <laughs> oh man. And you can see, we're just crushing it right now. Oh, nice. We got a tank. That's cool. All right, so we got we're on act three. We're almost at episode five. I think like closer to the end of episode four, this may be this. This is where it's going to start getting a little bit more difficult. And uh, what is it? Uh, episode five is going to get a little crazy. I'm not sure if I want to level. I want. I'm not sure if I want to level up Lin yet, because I may need the EXP for something else. It's for like a specific part within one of the episodes. This <clears throat> Okay, here we go. This might. This might be a little challenging. Only because, like, if they get near the ship, this could, that could spell out bad news for us. Ooh, nice. Man, these episodes, they bring back awesome memories. Let's see. Okay, so she had. Oh yeah, that's right. I can give her something different. Oh, I can't right now. Oh, and it looks like. Okay, so yeah, and uh, also too, like as as you increase in the episodes, the Eternium cost will go up. So just be mindful of that. That's why I, I didn't really spend too much on what I was doing before with the Eternium. Cause we gotta make sure we get, we have enough to do these things. Okay, let's make her a little stronger. Again, we're not, we're not really, we're not really worried too much about the set bonuses right now because this is not really the type of gear that we're really focused on. We'll focus on that once we get the much better gear for our units 
or in other words like you guys don't have to really worry about the blue items don't and also remember what i was saying from before um do not do not level these type of gear up you don't need to level any of them up the ones you want to focus on is the gold six tier spe uh very specific ones and the gold tier sevens now there are some uh, unique ones like the antagonist gear and the devil gear. You can, it's fine to level those up because they do prove pretty useful even in the end game. At least in my experience, I've, you know, I've used those uh, type of gear sets. For specific PVE content and all that stuff, whatever you know, the game throws at us. Oh, nice! They've given us two units this time. That's pretty good. Okay, so we're getting pretty close to the end. We are smooth sailing right now. They hit Lin a little too hard. <laughs> nice. Itima boss, Sumiran, Yang Chung Mong Charam, Kodom number. Silver lining. Okay, so probably after this one, I'm going to level up Lin. Uh, Zhao Lin. Uh oh. Yeah, see, they, they touched the ship. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna start leveling up some more units. Right. Not bad. <laughs> All right, Act Four. All 
Okay, so we're gonna level up Lin, and we're gonna. Going to, uh, let's see. You know, we're gonna end up using all of this for the purples. Um, you know what? Hold on. Um, yeah, yeah. You know what? Yeah, yeah. We're, we're gonna do that. I'm gonna get her up to ninety. Okay, I lied. Maybe 91. <laughs> okay, so at this point, I'm going to... Let me see if I can get her to 80. I'm going to I'm gonna attempt to try and get more units to level 90 at least. Let me see if I can get the twins up. Yeah, let me see if we can get the twins up there. We're, we're definitely going to need them to be stronger <laughs> see this is why it's always good to make sure you may have a, a nice um nice stack of credits on hand just in case yeah we're gonna get linzen up here now <laughs> That would be a good idea. Oh, you know what? She's been operating like this without any gear. We gotta get her something. <laughs> we gotta get her at least some armor for more health. Okay. Yeah, no wonder she was taking a lot of damage. Alright, so we got 80. Let's see if we can get Chinatsu up there. Okay, 73 is fine. As you can see, we're about to reach 2,000 again. Once we reach 2,000, I might... I might end up getting I might end up starting to spend a little bit of the quartz just to get like maybe 10,000 or 20,000 Eternium just to get more EXP to try and level all of these units up to like level 100 so this is it. this is the reason why I was saying it's always best to make sure you know you you get a good amount you save up a good amount of quartz and don't use it for like the rolls like even in the beginning you know when they give you like the free the free SSR if you do what is it uh, 30 30 rolls so like basically you know you just you just do three ten pulls basically but you get a free SSR now you can choose to do that to get the you know get a free SSR or you can save that and just save it for more farming but it's up to you I mean personally for me is like you know either or is it's good I mean, you can't really go wrong, but also too, it is a free SSR, so yeah. And you're always gonna keep getting, you know, more quartz. The game will keep giving you quartz. It'll be a little slower, but it does give you quartz. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll keep continuing with this one. Yeah, I'm just trying to make sure that we're strong enough to take on episode 5. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Oh man, she barely has any health. What happened? <laughs> As you can see though, Lin is... She's killing it. Uh, Zhao Lin. Oh, nice. Got another one. Another tank. Uh oh. Oh, here we go. Okay, so this is the one I was talking about. You see that little seed ship? This, this, this is the one, this is the part where it can get challenging because the siege ship will all the siege uh, unit will always keep trying to go after your ship, and because we have a level one ship, this is where it can get real challenging. But it looks like we're doing pretty good so far. Okay, so we're doing we're doing pretty good so far. I think there's gonna be like a there's gonna be a few more of these that's gonna keep showing up. Um, I think I think it's gonna be either on either more on this episode or it's gonna be on episode five. So this is the main reason why I was su I was suggesting to you guys to make sure like you level up your units, you know, as you go along, and to make sure you know you, you just level them up efficiently. Because you're gonna get to a certain part like this, and especially if you have a level one ship, those siege units can literally one shot the ship. So you got you got to make sure that you have strong enough units to destroy it before that happens. And th th this is what I was, you know, uh, following from there. This is what I was trying to prepare you guys for. But if you follow the steps, if you follow the proper steps from all the parts of the episodes of the tutorial. You guys should be fine, no problem. Okay, so this time they got a tank right here that's gonna try and push us back. Oh, look, we got some extra units. Nice. Yeah, <laughs> 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 Ah, alter aggressive, alter aggressive Seoyun. Man, she, she has one of the coolest theme songs ever, and she looks awesome. Oh yeah, see, she she's starting to attack the ship. So we gotta be extra careful about this. Yeah, see this this is what I this is what I was talking about. See where we can easily lose, even if we have like high enough units, but it's a good thing that we're we've been, you know, we've been following the proper steps and we've been um, properly leveling up our units and gearing them up as much as we can just to prepare us for situations like this
I don't even know how we even got hit with the ship. <clears throat> I must have been, I must have missed something. <laughs> okay. I think this might be the end of episode four. Nice. Okay, so now we are at episode five. And we've unlocked the danger close. Nice. Okay. Oh, guys, I forgot to tell you this, too. So, when you've completed these uh, these certain missions for these episodes, they do give you uh, metal rewards. So, depending on how many medals you've unlocked, they do give you a huge amount of quartz, by the way, as well. So, you can easily just start collecting these. So this is for the entire episode, um, episode four. So if you want, you could just go back here and start collecting more of your quartz. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna collect some more quartz and this allows us to farm more efficiently. Look at that, nice amount of quartz. So be sure to, you know, don't forget to collect these and you'll get a huge amount of quartz. Like I said, <laughs> you do things the right way and you'll, you'll be as efficient as possible. Okay, so we did episode four. We collected the quartz here. Okay, so now what we're going to do is this is because this is from here on. This is going to be this is towards the start of the end game content <clears throat> so what we're gonna do is we're going to increase our eternium but before we do that let's just go and unlock more of these missions and achievements let's get some more credits all right nice and I'm sure we've done plenty more battles, so we can start getting these unlocked. And we finished our daily again. See what I mean? You don't really have to do much. You just got to keep playing. Like you pretty much just play the game, and you just start up. You just start, um, you know, completing these missions. The weeklies, but this is what I was saying too. Like for the weeklies here, now you can easily complete these all the way up to level 50 even without completing the weeklies it's the dailies that's really important you want to you want to make sure you're doing these every single day because you can you could definitely finish like possibly maybe 14 days like 14 days left and you could complete this whole entire thing so it's it, it's it's definitely possible and even without you know even as keeping it as just seven out of ten so long as you keep this like at least seven out of ten or six out of ten with the weeklies, you'll definitely be able to finish this, uh, finish this level, uh, you know, the counter pass level all the way up to level fifty with just this here, you know, as a seven to ten. But so long as this is completed, then you're all set. Now you can complete all this too if you want, <clears throat> just so you can complete things quicker. That's also a good thing. Um. Yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to increase our Eternium a little bit more. So we're going to spend the 250 quarts. Now, be mindful, each day, like every day when the, the game, you know, resets the dailies, they also reset the pricing for the Eternium as well. So each day it'll reset to about 50. But when you use up the 50, see there's a timer here before it restocks and then you get another set right here, but this time it's a little bit higher, which is 75. So we're gonna do that as well. We're gonna do 10, which and this one right here is gonna be about 750. But as you can see here, we got a nice amount of quartz here. So we can get that 20,000. So you can get about 30,000 for this. And now we're gonna go back and we're gonna farm again. <laughs> we're gonna make sure that we have these units all leveled up but you know what we're gonna do something a bit different because i think that we might be strong enough now 
to do the higher content. So let's see what happens. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be a little bit challenging, all only because you know they, all because they they're they're attacking the ship. <laughs> See, the last time we attempted this, they they ended up destroying the ship and whatnot, but uh, we might be in trouble. Yeah, we're still still not strong enough yet. Uh, I mean, we were pretty close. Pretty close. Pretty close. What we, what we're, what we're lacking right now is a, a tank, and I think, I think, I think it's about time we start trying to do that. We might have to start, yeah, we might have to start investing in a tank now. Let me see something. What tanks do I have? Ooh, okay, so we do have a shieldman, and we do have the hound. Now, the hound tends to push the enemy back. And the, I think the shieldmen, they could do a little bit of a pushback, but they usually just keeps, keeps you in place. Hmm. I'm not sure. Let's. You know what? what? What we could do? Let me see what happens here. Let me. Let me see. Does he have any type of gear? Or yeah, they do. I can do that. Nice. Okay. You know what? Um. What we could do. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try something out. I'm gonna switch this up a bit. Yeah, let's let's see if that works. And let's see, do I have enough yet? No, not well I do have here, but I need a few more here. I wonder, do I have anything? Oh, yes, I do. Look at that. From the world maps. Okay, it's not exactly what I wanted, but... I, I needed more of the other stuff. Um, hmm. Yeah, not really sure. But I will do this, though. Let's see what, what I get. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, gear, craft, and materials. Yeah, I could always use those. That's fine. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I think... I might have enough to make another ship. <clears throat> A very powerful one. Okay, so we got the new Ohio. Okay, maybe not. Yeah. Okay, that's that's not a problem. Would love to get one of these ships, but that's okay. So we'll just we'll just stick to the original plan for now. We'll stick to that. Uh, we'll do about yeah, ninety three. Ninety three should be fine. And then, as you can see, if it, it could go higher this time, so now it's at a hundred. And if you do the hundred, you you would be literally spending. Oh, actually, there's no limit to this. But yeah, I'd recommend like waiting until the timer for these run out. That way, it's it's just so much cheaper and it's more efficient that way. You don't want to spend all of your quartz. Let's see. Okay, so we'll go to mainstream. <clears throat> and we'll start episode 5. Okay, so... Let's get Chifuyu up there. We're definitely gonna need Chifuyu. Uh oh. Nice. Hmm. Do we have another? We do another SSR, right? <clears throat> I probably, yeah, I most definitely should probably invest in a tank. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll, we'll, we'll invest in a tank. Nice. Uh, I'm probably going to keep him at, like, at least level 70. Yeah, we can keep him at level 70. That's, that, that'll be fine. Okay, let's see what happens. <clears throat> okay, so this is level 60 now. Oh, 
최대 출력으로 하늘을 안 넘겨줄 거예요. 제가 봐도 알았다. 자, 야, 야, 자, 도와줄게요. 어, oh, yeah, nice, because they had a sniper over here, too. Oh, yeah, nice, they had a sniper over here, too. Nice. 다시 출발합니다. 이쯤아 보스, 승리란 일장 충몽처럼 겁없는 법. Oh, nice. Got a Kim. 그럼 제가 replace this unit for now. 오늘 gonna use this. 채워볼까? I think we had more copies of this unit, right? Or did I end up using it any? Did I end up using it already? No. Yeah, we got another one right here. Nice. <clears throat> And Lin Zen, I think I have more copies of Lin Zen. Yeah, I do. Nice. Okay, so she's gonna do a little bit more damage. We should be good with this, but I'm gonna see if I can get them to level 90 instead. Maybe at least close to it. Yeah, at least close to it. Nice. All right, let's see what happens. Uh oh. Okay, what's up, guys? So, yeah, the game ended up, uh, what is it? The emulator ended up crashing. But that was a really long time, though, before it, it actually crashed. So maybe there's some small improvements to it, maybe? I don't know. But, um, yeah, we're, we're going to continue on with the uh, episode 5. We're gonna see so we're gonna see if we can at least get to I'd say maybe act two or maybe act three depending on how this goes. Oh yeah, this is getting crazy now. Yeah, it's a good thing we started leveling up our units. Yeah, so long as we keep them in place, we should be good. But as you can see, the content is getting a little bit more challenging now. <laughs> that never gets old. <laughs> yeah, maybe we can finish two acts. Let's see if we can get away with that. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. 
It's when it's when we get to like at least I think Act Three and up. That's when things starts to get you know um, a bit hectic. Category four, okay. Uh oh. We really gotta get um Lin's in some more gear. Oh man. It's getting a little tricky. <laughs> Okay. Itzima boss, 승리란 일장 충몽처럼 겁없는 법. Nice. Okay, cool. So we got to Act Two. Okay, let's see if we can finish Act Two, and then we're gonna do a few more things here. Yeah, these things, the abominations, these are going to be a bit difficult. And you're about to see why. So, these abominations, they have a really, like, they have a, a, a large pushback on a radius. So, I'm wondering if it's, if it's here in this story or if it's in one of the challenge ones. <laughs> Yeah, see? They're doing a, a nice pushback right there. But because we got the specific units that we have here, they can pretty much overcome it. <laughs> okay, here we go.
I like that theme song. It's so cool. Oh boy, here we go. It's starting to get a little crazy. Oh yeah, see the thing right here. He's moving towards the ship. Yep. Okay, so now this is where the challenging part is coming from. Okay. Not to worry, so we just have to we just have to pretty much pretty much switch it up a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah, we might do it this way. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, see, you gotta be a little bit careful. Sometimes it's always good to just rearrange the the um the deployment order and you should be fine because sometimes that can make a big difference and they're gonna knock us back but it's not gonna really matter Nice. Okay, I might... No, no, we, we'll keep it like this again, because I think we have to fight more of the abominations. Oh, I wonder, does Orca join us in this one? Because that would be awesome if she did. Okay, so that, that robot's going to try and destroy us. Hopefully Maria can take care of it before it's too late. There we go. Uh oh. Nice, nice. That was pretty close. Okay, we'll get Shifuyu out. Nobody's getting past Maria. Nice. Yeah, as you can see, it's starting to get a little challenging now. This is where it gets serious. Again, it's not to worry. So long as you guys have been following the steps, you guys will be fine. Even when it gets a little hectic. See, now you're starting to see how it's all coming together now.
Alright, so this might be another another tough one. Oh man. That 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 front striker enemy is like brutal, man. They, they are pretty agile. But the twins got it. <laughs> We're just having like a whole shootout. <laughs> nice. Oh no, Shifuyu. Alright, so we got Maria still. Okay, got Linens. Got uh, Ein. It's away. Nice. Fantastic. Nice. Okay, it's getting a little challenging, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, so this might, that might have been the last abomination that we've destroyed. Yep, okay, so we made it to Act 3. Nice. Okay, so things are starting to get a little... Little hectic a little bit. Oh, look, we got some more missions that we've completed. See, on the consortium. So now we get like the weeklies and then we get like, you know, few, few points here and there. Then when you sign in, you just go through the middle, max this out. And there you go, you just get more points. It, eventually, you'll be able to go into the, the, the consortium shop. And, um,. You know, you get to spend the uh, these uh, little things right here, these currency, and get some, you know, some more materials that you may need. Okay, so we got another free one right here. Okay, so this is good, and. I'm curious. I want to see what the daily has today. Okay, so they got these. I'm going to spend a little bit on this. And that one. This one and that one. And that one. You know what? I'm just going to get all of them. The ones that are for the credits. Okay. Oh, nice, because we, we do have enough. So what we're going to do is we're going to get this, which is only costs 50. I really want to get this. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to get that only because um, Yang really does need to get ranked up now. Because at, at this at this point in the story now, we might want to start ranking, um, you know, ranking up uh, Yang's ability. So let's just do a max for now. Want to get her a little bit closer to completion. Because she's going to play a very crucial part. Alright, so we're one away. So now we need about 18 more of these. And we need about 90. Which that this one may not... Miss. Well, this one's not going to be really a problem. But this one we're gonna, it's going to be a little bit challenging. But we can now get our skills up there again. Oh, 
What's this? Uh, more cooldown. Um, no, it is fine. We can keep this at two. We want to get this at five at least first. Okay, so we got the four dispatch missions here. Oh, right. I don't think... I don't think we could do the... Other missions. Uh, the one where we can help people out yet, I think. I think there's a part we have to beat first. All right, that's no problem. So what we could do is we could go here. Dive 30, let's see. Oh, right, right, because we do need more ships to do this. That's it. Right, we can just do it this way. No, we'll do that. And then put you here. And then we'll use this unit. And we should be good. But we only got like one ship though. Oh yeah, we could do a sweep though. That's that that's always good. So we gotta, we're just gonna skip all the way to the boss. It's only like a level 30, so we should be fine. So long as they don't touch the ship. <laughs> Cause they can they can do a lot of damage to the ship. ここ引っ掛けた。ちっかで取り除いてる。いるでしょ。괜찮아。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ。ドライ
we're going to attempt to finish episode five. Um, but you guys already see how, uh, you know, a little bit challenging is starting to get now. Even when I have like, you know, most of them up to like level 90s and only one level 100 awaken, you can see just how challenging it could be. And, um, yeah, but you see also too, where, you know, we're able to get like the courts and this is why I was telling you guys, you know, before it, it's important to do the dailies and to, um, to effectively farm your EXP appraisals. And to just try to evenly level them up, stick to the, you know, the 10 level rule or a little bit higher than that. So long as you have the resources, always pay attention to managing your credits. As you can see, it's like I haven't really been going below 10 mil. So I've been keeping an eye, a steady eye on this to make sure I don't overspend. And, the, and as you keep following these steps... This is the, the credits is just going to keep rolling in. It's going to keep increasing. And the more units that you level up to max, the more, you know, the easier the game is going to start becoming for you. This is like, I think, like day four or day five of this. And look how far we've gotten so far with this brand new account. But yeah, if you guys found this, um, this uh, tutorial useful... Um, feel free to leave a like and if you didn't find it useful feel free to leave a dislike but uh yeah the next episode we're definitely gonna try and and get through this because i'm gonna be doing this every step of the way with you guys um but yeah till next time guys uh stay chill and remember don't fear the reaper <laughs>